okay. No, you weren't invited. And who invited you? You gotta pick up the pace, Frank. The horse getting into the hole we blew open. Are you bailing? I'm with you, Frank. Destroy that generator. You guys seriously get paid enough for this? That's perfect! Hang on, I'm almost there. almost there! I think. Vale, os den por culo. Oye, me ha el traje. I owe you one, Hammond. Está Good feo. Luck, Frank. Give Fontana hell. All right, I need to find Barnaby's research. Brad said it'd be in some kind of intelligence lockup. Gonna need to look around. West, I intercepted another one of Vic's reports. Fine, play it. Frank is back in Willamette. And surprise, he brought his stupid smug face with him. You know, for a second, I was actually glad to see him. I thought, finally, together we'll make some progress. Once he sees how the people are doing, he'll... You know what? Never mind. <laughs> Screw that guy. Research facility, huh? Based off the work of the late, great Dr. Barnaby, perhaps? Come on, Frank. Ugh, no test subject quite like a live one. Hey there, little guy. Commander Fontana has reviewed all progress on Project Saturn. No addressee. Right, because that'd be too easy. Teasers? What are you gonna send them to college?
la purga. Brad said all the stuff they took from Barnaby's lab will be in some kind of intel lockup, which is somewhere else. Okay, gotta keep looking. Lockdown terminated. Have a nice day. Screw you, Dor! Eh, nitrógeno líquido. Siempre viene bien. I smell zombies. I gotta clear them out before I can do any serious looking. Mejor esto ha sido una liada. Ah, bueno. Vale. Que se me había desconectado lo, los cascos. Pero voy a asegurarme. Que hay veces. Que, que se desconecten es equivalente a... This intel lockup. God damn, there must be thousands of files here. Oh, this is part of the treatment chamber I saw in Barnaby's lab. The tag has coordinates. Ah! 
There we go. The missing files, all stamped November 25th. There we go, Barnaby's missing computer stuff. Retrieved by Recon Team Nova 6. What is that? So they raided Barnaby's lab on November 25th. That'll be the date I need to find the right info. All right, let's see, November, yes! Oh, yes! You are one sexy little surveillance record. I'm gonna take you to a computer and watch you so hard. Okay. Now, let's see. Hey. Hey there, little guy. How you doing? <coughs> oh, damn. <laughs> Guess you ought to be more careful next time. What happened? He got my way. Power coming on. Well, all right. Hanson, perimeter. Copy. Vargas. Inventory, pick it, tag it, cat it. Roger that. McCall, get your head out of your ass. Power and safety, I don't want any accidents. Already on it. Seizure team is inbound. They're gonna be here within the hour. I want this place mapped out, you hear me? Yes, yes sir. sir. Good. The body was cremated at 1500 hours. My seventh failure. And <clears throat> September 19th, 2006, Dr. Russell Barnaby. This is likely my final progress report. There's been an outbreak in the Willamette Mall. I didn't cause it. I don't know who did it. I don't even know how it's possible. Containment leak, maybe? I just, I don't know. The experiment remains LC. incomplete. Conservatively, it needs another what? 50 years research. All the data is there, uploaded into my Good. primary storage. That's what we're talking about. Let's get it. Perhaps some smart young scientist can make use of it. Downloading. The treatment itself remains locked at 62% effectiveness. It represents the pure truth of my creation. Oh, there? Undeath, they call it. Ha! The world has known no greater irony. Take away the decay, the bestial wrath, the failure of the mind. Ask yourself, what remains? A zombie is just a man who never tires, never sickens, never ages. Indeed, zombies are the key to human immortality. And yet, since the livestock angle didn't pan out, oh, these Pentagon idiots remain fixated on weaponizing the plague. Proof of that, I, too, have put in a safe place. Well, I've been summoned by an unknown agent, likely to my death. The voice was familiar. Perhaps an employee or a citizen of Santa Cabeza. If so, I must go prepared. If anyone survived that incident, and if they know my name and contact information, <clears throat> it's likely they blame me for what happened. <sighs> Additionally, the infected population grows apace. If I was a sane man, I would stay below. But I must confess to an irrational desire to witness my handiwork. Should I become infected, I must return here and use the test chamber. A last ditch effort to save myself from the plague I created. So then, farewell. Let it be known that I fought to my last to protect life. And yet, in so doing, caused untold death. Ugh! What the hell is going on? Hands! Get out of there! Move it! Move! Yeah. <sighs>
Okay. What the hell? Attention, we've got a pest infestation in the intelligence lockup. Oh shit. Fontana! You don't scare me. I know who started the outbreak. It was Calder, one of your soldiers. Charlie Squad, redeploy to the basement. Flush him out. I gotta get the hell out of here. Locked! Ugh. There's gotta be a way out of here. How the hell do you Obscurus troops get around? What have we here? Ah, ah, still warm. Okay. Frank, you there? What's going on? Uh, a little busy, but the Cliffs notes are that Calder asshole's got our big scoop and Fontana's trying to murder me. Wait, what? Trapped. Monster asshole. Fontana, talk later. <sighs> Oh, God, that's a lot of steps. I don't recall authorizing your press pass. Uh, I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to finish Barnaby's research. Parley zombieism into some kind of immortality treatment. I'm trying to make a mint off a bunch of aging millionaires. That was the plan, but I guess immortality isn't as profitable as cheap labor. What? At first, the client just wanted to exploit Dr. Barnaby's research, but then these things, these smart zombies, started showing up and the mission changed. Pacify, domesticate, and train. You plan to make soldiers, aren't you? You're gonna make some kind of undead army. Are you out of your mind? You think anyone's gonna set these things loose with a gun? No. No, the plan was coffee farmers. Really? Oh, well, there is a lot of money in coffee. Or manufacturing, or meatpacking, or, or fucking fruit, I don't know. Peanuts. Peanuts are hard to harvest, just a thought. Cheap, unskilled labor exported to whoever's buying. I get up back this with these guys. Yeah, when, who are these guys? You are, Frank. Assuming you pay your taxes. Say goodbye, Mr. West. I'll get the story, Fontaine! Ah. Commander, we are inbound to your position. Do you need assistance? 
Resistance, copy! Negative, do not come here. Se la ha soplado. Pretty self sacrificing for a mercenary. Wolves take care of their back, West. Okay. Obscurus had what I needed. So Hammond took a break from planning a revolution to help me bust into the base. Okay, we may have left the front door open behind us. The carnage was, well, let's just say they got what they deserved. I learned Obscurus was using Barnaby's research to create zombie slaves, which is multiple shades gross. And Calder? Here's a good one. Stop me if you've heard it before. An exosuit and a zombie have a baby. It's large, angry, and has the data I need to crack this thing wide open. And I need it now more than ever, because with Fontana dead, there's no way to prove that this whole thing is the government's handiwork. And that's the punchline. I gotta get out of this death trap and find Calder. I need that hard drive. Oh, God. Somebody, please help! anyone, I swear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get out of here before I change my mind. I will. Damn it, I swear it. I hope Hammond's coup is a lot less bloody than this. Si no, pide ayuda. Are you there? Ah, oh, shit. Keep it together, Hammond. I'm not gonna leave you hanging. Por aquí. Sí. Eh, vale, esto es un atajo. You chipped the paint! Me 
mierda. No contaba yo con eso. I'm heading there now. Hammond's coup failed. What's wrong with the shelter? It's in lockdown, but something's not right. Check it out, then call me. Damn it! Why can't zombie outbreaks ever be simple? Ooh, good traction. Bueno, eso de buena tracción es relativo. Se va más el puto cot. Frank, no hables. This place is out of control. Gonna find some higher ground, get a better look. Zoom in. Oh, wow. Electric fence. Well, I have zero interest in a free defibrillation, thanks. Okay. Those aren't zombies. Brad. Flashing orange lights. What do they mean? Override lockdown. Nothing gets in or out until the system is reset. There's a panel around back. Hit the reset switch and the exterior doors will open. And that's what I gotta do. Hold on. What about Calder? Saving Hammond won't get you that Pulitzer. Uh, yeah, I know, Brad. It's just... I owe her one, all right? <sighs> all right, what open sesame, shitheads. Systems reset, Frank. Get in there fast, or the zombies will get to Hammond before you do. Oh, shit, I hadn't thought about that. <sighs> Got a bullet! Yeah. Hammond, I'm here to rescue you! Frank, how'd the zombies get in, man? Connor? Uh, no idea, but I'm taking care of it. Hey, uh, Brad! There are a lot of zombies in here! No kidding. There'll be three doors. You'll need to shut them from the inside. Why don't you just die? We don't have any weapons! Vale. Relief, 
but I need to focus on not pissing myself. God, I hope Hammond's all right. What do you mean? She's not here? Tom's people took her and Jordan. We tried to go back for her, but those hillbilly dicks hit the lockdown. Tom's probably holding her at the farm. I'll go check. Keep your radio on. I'll shout if I learn anything. Thanks, bud. Glad you're one of the good guys. Vale, pero esto se ocupará el, el logo del mañana. Porque el de hoy no va a ser. <ríe> La verdad.